Hi to Chaco. We have this game here, best of three. We have a uh, death knight. We have some ghouls. We have tomb of relics, a ziggurat, and there's a ghoul scouting. Here's a wisp scouting. We have a tree ancient war going up and a demon hunter for foggy. Death knight against the demon hunter. Look at this scouting. The ghoul scouts over there. The wisp scouted over there. They now both know that the opponent is not over there. But what do they? What do they uh, know besides that? Well, he sends out another ghoul. This ghoul is cutting south. This ghoul, look at this scout. Very beautiful. This ghoul, are under he does find Foggy over here. So, does he go for backpack? No, no backpack. The ghoul cannot steal any items. What is this? There's a demon under painkiller. Gonna kill. The null overseer's pain. And the only way to kill his pain is to end his life. The ghoul wants the last hit, but does he uh, have a chance here with painkiller? Doing so much damage. Um, no, painkiller gets the last hit. Ring of protection. The two ghouls are going for the archer. The archer retreats. And the null. Oh, wait, the death knight did get the null. Definitely get, uh, gets the level 3 with no warden. So some more skeletons. What skeleton go for the archer? The demon does get the other null. But he's missing that 48 XP. That the death knight stole. Of course Foggy is now in China guys. He has better ping now than Lucifer. Usually when they play in Europe. Uh, <laughs> European tournaments. The ping is also pretty fair because they play on uh, on bots that make the ping super duper fair. The Death Knight wants his uh, wispy. Does he coil it? He doesn't have coil. He has an uh, unholy aura first. Skeleton cannot reach the wisp. If he only could throw his sword at the wisp, he could maybe kill it. Death Knight here blocking the painkiller for a little bit. Oh, Death Knight going back home. We have five ghouls over there. We have uh, more ghouls under. Wait, the skeleton tries to kill the archer. Archer skeleton goes down. Duke Wintermall, level one. The ghouls, we have five, six ghouls. What a game, guys. Demon Hunter here. What a game. What a game. There's another archer being built. Seven ghouls here for Lucifer. Lucifer likes to play aggressive uh, in this matchup. He likes to build a lot of ghouls and just go into the Knight of Base, kill some wisps, maybe kill and cancel a Moonwell or something. Maybe surround the Demon Hunter. Demon Hunter does have boots though, so he's pretty difficult to surround. There's four archers now, the Ancient War of Boots. He's like, okay, four is enough. Is four enough? Taco flavored keysies. Thanks, Danaman, for subscribing with Twitch Prime. Your support is absolutely beautiful. And welcome to Chaco Bell. And the sheep goes down. And the other sheep also goes down. I'll give you some taco flavor keys after the game. Uh, this, uh, to that sheep, are you serious? That's so sad. That's so sad. This archer gets around it though. And this ghoul goes home. There's a dust, so the archer dies. The ghoul will go down, but that will give Lucifer a little bit of time to do some damage or to move into position uh, to do some damage. Like this hunter's hall oh, could maybe be canceled. Demon hunter kills that ghoul. Hunter's Hole, I mean, I think he could go for the Hunter's Hole. But maybe he doesn't want to. Maybe he doesn't want to cancel the Hunter's Hole because then Foggy will go for Ancient of Winds. Team Hunter's level 2, he gets the, ske uh, the Skeleton. Yeah, the Skeleton. Does he get this Archer? He tries to get the Archer. He wants to surround this Archer. Like He needs this Archer. He wants it. Just, he wants it so badly. He sends a ghoul home. Archer survives. He's ghoul. Oh, this ghoul is in danger. Demon Hunter does so much damage, but the Death Knight blocks the Demon Hunter a little bit. This ghoul is still in danger, though. Oh, Nagachan, is he going to go for the ghoul? Yes, he goes for the ghoul. So there's one dead ghoul, thanks to the Naga. Let's see if uh, we get more dead ghouls, thanks to that Naga. I think um, if he would have gone Panda Dorado, though, the ghoul would have also died. So, so far, I don't think the Naga is worth it. Panda. 
of course, uh, stronger later in the game. Naga stronger early in the game. Oh, Naga, are you? Be careful, Naga Chan. Be careful. Oh, Naga Chan, is she gonna be surrounded? She is surrounded. This one ghoul might die. Uh, there's no staff or anything. This ghoul is definitely dead. And okay, he gives the TP to Naga. This ghoul survives. Okay. Okay, guys. Death Knight is still level 1. 88 XP. The uh, Angel of War already in position with the archers to creep the creep camp. Double Angel of Lore going up. And Lucy is too far across the map to cancel anything over here, so he's just gonna creep. And there is a Lich. Do you imagine Naga creeping here? Now, as you guys know, as I've said already 500,000 times, the Naga. I don't like the Naga in this matchup. You really need to get like at least two ghoul kills thanks to that Naga. But I think, uh, you know, the Naga didn't get any. The Panda would have gotten just as many ghoul kills as the Naga did. So, Lucifer, can he make the comeback late game or comeback? Is he behind? Can't, I can't really say he's behind. Do we have a tree down. of life yet? I don't see any, so... Usually with the Naga we have either uh, early expansion or very late expansion. But sometimes we have a normal timed expansion. So in other words, uh, the expansion is just... The timing of the expansion is less consistent with the Naga than with the Panda. Uh, which makes it a bit diff more difficult for them that, right? They need to keep scouting. They need to know exactly when the expansion goes up. These two ghouls... We're going back home. The Lich here picks up the tome. This troll trapper here is dead. Whoa. This ogre is dead. And this ogre is also going to die. There's some cool frenzy. There's a statue. There's some fiends. The skeleton wants his wisp. There's a polished magic. A dead bears. Bears. Okay. This skeleton is just going to expire though. So the wisp will be fine. What item did we get here? Periapt. What item did we get here? Sobi mask. Okay. Okay, guys. Okay. Let's see what we get here. Wool one third. Blade one third. He makes expo once he creeps a spot. I'm not sure about that. Usually with the Naga. If you if you don't get an early uh, expansion, sometimes we see like a tier one expansion or something, right? Or a tier um, or a very early tier two expansion. Uh, but then usually, if they don't get for the don't get that early expansion, what they try to do is just win one fight with the Naga, and then build that expansion, or get some kind of advantage, then build that expansion. We have the Naga here for Lucifer. So Lucifer, is he going? He's going for the story form. He has a statue in his base. I forgot to check what item we got. Belt of Giant Strength, not a very good item. This demon is pretty hard to kill. Scourge bunch times here. Uh, Naga in trouble though. Hello. She, hello. She was like full hit points and now she's dead. And uh, nice banner birds. He knew exactly how much damage he needed to do to the Naga to kill her. There's an info potion used on this Naga. This dried uh, does go down. The Demon is now in trouble, even though he had so much hit points, but he used the Info Potion. The Demon Death Knight also has the Info Potion. In worst case scenario, he can use this. The bear takes so much damages. Is he going to die? Uh, the Matterbird for 44. The bear goes down. This Dryad is still alive. The Lich is a ghoul. There's a Nova. The Demon is, is is he dead, guys? Um, he does have no boots, so, but he gets away. Uh, this Dryad dies. So the list is level 3 now. This doesn't look good for... Happy is not in this game. Doesn't look good for Foggy, guys. And what do I always say? Well, Chaco, you say a lot. You say a lot always. But let's talk about something that's important. Um, this is kind of like WZ style, right? With these heroes with uh, without Frostworms. This is... Foggy's, uh, Foggy's supposed to be good in this matchup. When there's no frost runs, usually Foggy does win in this matchup. He usually beats WZ. He usually beats other players that uh, play without frost runs. Happy always plays frost runs against Foggy and always wins. That's what he's weak against. 
But now he's even losing. Fuck, he's even losing against this no Frostburn play. Is is it a sign, guys? Is this a sign that Foggy is going to lose in the group stages against WFZ next week? Maybe. He maybe thought he was creep tagging Lucy. Is this a best of five? No, it's a best of three. A town is under I think. Siege. So, Coil, the archer is dead. Where? This for at 49 supply. Foggy at 42. Foggy has no expansion. Foggy has no level 3 Naga. Although she's close. Foggy has only two bears. There's an Antimatic Shell, which can be uh, dispelled in this what he does. And there's a Coil Nova, etc. This demon has, has so many survivability items, but it's still not enough. They're going to dry it. This bear is in trouble. We have a staff. Does he staff the bear? Uh, no, the bear dies. Maybe he was afraid because the demon hunter was over there uh, with only 500 hit points. So he thought, maybe I have to staff the demon hunter instead. So he didn't staff the bear. But I feel like he's behind. He should just take the risks. Take the risky plays that will, uh, maybe, that should, you know, pay off. So he should have saved the bear, I think. This uh, fiend here in the back almost dies. The staff is still, he can still staff something. This dryad here, doing just fine. Uh, there goes a the wisp. This bear doing just fine. This team hunter. Okay, well, this bear takes so much damage, guys. There's staff. This is staff. This time, this time he does staff the bear. This attack, of course, is no damage. It actually disappeared. Uh, he eats some rejuvenated with the destroyer. There's another one on the dry this time. There goes the ghoul. Okay, and. There's a mana burn on the Naga, and there's Fork Lightning and Nova, this Demon Hunter, this staff of cooldown still, it is. Uh, there's a mana potion, Demon Hunter's death, that's GG, maybe, maybe, there it is. GG. GG, guys. This map heavily, heavily favors on that, right? Well, let me look at my stats here in the background. In the uh, in Firefox, I think I had them open. Firefox, okay. This is Amazonia. Night Elf versus Undead is it favors Night Elf? Yeah, it favors Night Elf. What did you ask? This map <laughs> heavily favors Undead? No, it heavily favors Night Elf, apparently. That's what the stats uh, say. There's a Demon Hunter, there's an Archer. What a game. The Ancient War roots up. Archer wakes up the creeps. Demon Hunter here. We have a Death Knight here. The player's forces are under attack. There's Lightning Shield on the Archer. Very nice. Demon Hunter almost out, guys. He's almost back. Let's see which one we get. Painkiller, ter Demon Terror, or whatever he's called, or Sin Dweller, or Shadow Song. Let's see. Sin Dweller! <laughs> Hey, Tom of Agility, how nice. Ring of Protection is also actually not that bad in this matchup. As we saw last game, this Demon Hunter is always the first target to be focused. And, you know, that's a situation where the Ring of Protection is actually a pretty decent item. In fact, I want I, I go as far to say it's, it's better than Claws of Haste or Claws of Attack in this matchup. Choco, you said too much. I, I won't take it back, guys. Uh, here we are get the Ring of Protection. That's, of course, really bad for Lucifer. His heroes never get focused. Well, a little bit, but compared to uh, more damage, he, he rather has more damage. This ghoul, though, there's a mana burn on the Death Knight. He's already level 2. Synth Weller also level 2. And there goes a the wizard guy. By the way, was it worth it to save the level 1 Naga with the TP? I think so. In that case, it was worth it. We have seven ghouls here. Usually in uh, in 1v1, it's worth to save your hero, level one hero with the TP, guys. Usually, not always. Usually, there's another ghoul. This death knight is level two, sells his TP. Very nice, just like, uh, and he's still tier one. He builds another, another ziggurat, by the way, another crypt. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, guys. 
Is Lutfer going all in? No, yeah, he is. Park champ. <laughs> Park champ, he is. <laughs> you you could yeah, you could already see that by building the third ziggler. This already very tier one build uh, very tier one focused build. But now with the second script, that's a lot. Of course Foggy knows this, he builds his ancient war, but he might still lose, guys. Foggy might still lose, even though he prepares for this. There's a coil on the goal. And he almost surrounds it for Archer, but she survives. Nice detonate. There's another ghoul. Does he surround the Demon Hunter? He surrounds the Demon Hunter, but there's Moonjuice here. Moonjuice. I don't think this one is in range. So he will survive for a bit, but and then he can TP. Maybe. Yeah. Okay, he's killing ghouls. Two dead ghouls. The uh, ghouls here in the back killing an archer, but Foggy might. Uh, no, Foggy doesn't micro. Archer dies. Uh, that archer really, there was no reason for her to die. If this was Moon, she wouldn't die. There goes the ghoul. There's uh, three. Oh, there goes another archer. The demon to TPs. He can drink some more moon juice. He still has four archers, though. The, the, but this archer is dead, so he still has three archers, though, is what I meant to say. We're almost at tier two, though. Do we get a panda? Does he have the money? Foggy doesn't have the money for a panda. Uh oh. Foggy in trouble. He's gonna sell some items. No, he has nothing to sell, really. Maybe he's gonna buy an item. <laughs> Buys his stuff. So he c if he gets surrounded, he can stuff out. His ghoul is in. Takes a coil. Phew, phew. Altar is gone, so now he cannot even get a second hero anymore. Lucifer. Hmm. Very nice defensive position here. Is Lucifer gonna back off? No, he's still going, guys. He's still going. Five archers, one demon hunter. Shredder is available. If someone needs a shredder, if someone wants a shredder, Death Knight just gonna creep to level three maybe and then go back in. These two ghouls, are they going home? Even if he gets level three, I think he goes for level two aura in this situation. There goes another Taskmaster. He is level 3. Although he gets a Replenishment Potion, which uh, means... Okay, does get level 2 in early aura. With the Replenishment Potion, the level 2 Coil would maybe make sense. Because you get a Coil if you use the Replenishment Potion. But, uh, of course, Coil on Ghouls, level 1, level 2, hardly makes a, makes a difference. So, he does use the Replenishment Potion. So, he can use one Coil on this, this Ghoul over there. Okay, is he going back in? What is this? Hunter's Hall. This Ancient War maybe should have uprooted Eden the Tree and, you know, be here as well with the other Ancient of War. Oh, and Lucifer buys a Shredder. I was kind of expecting Foggy to buy it because he cannot get the second hero. But Lucifer gets it. And he's just cutting apart this uh, Hunter's Hall. It's going down super duper fast. Lucifer going back in. Lucifer at how much supply? 50 supply. Foggy at 26, guys. Foggy has Moonwells, Foggy has Ancient Wars though, and Trees of uh, Ages. The Archer, oh, this Ghoul takes a coil. Does he use the dust already? No, yeah, there's the dust. Okay, one Ghoul goes down, one Archer, but trading one for one is really good for Lucifer, because he has like 20 Ghouls, while Foggy only has like two Archers. And this Ghoul, oh, this Ghoul, is he dead? He's dead. The Demon Hunter kills him, this Archer is also dead. This Archer over there is uh, very low. There goes the shop. There goes another Archer. And meanwhile, the Shredder is still going for uh, for this Hunter's Hole, but it's up, actually. The Hunter's Hole went up. Uh, I'm not sure if it's such an important building to kill. Like, the Hunter's Hole is doing nothing. It's not like with Season of Ancient Protectors. It's not like with Season of Ancient of Lords going up. The Altar of Elders goes down. We have a Lucifer sh <laughs> Pisces Shredder. Uh, not a Shredder, a Zeppelin. To save his ghouls. There, uh, one ghoul dies. And a Sepper. He buys a Sepper. Kills the Tree of uh, War. And there's a mana burn right in the face of the Death Knight for 47. And this demon has two healing potions. He will, uh, he's hard to kill. Oh, he built a Huntress. Okay, that's what the Huntress fall was for. For this one Huntress. Uh, which makes sense, but, uh, this, this Zeppelin is just saving all the ghouls. I think he will defend though. Slowly, maybe. Oh, the Zeppelin, why did, oh, he releases the ghouls over there, but his ghoul, oh, picks up the ghoul. These ghouls, he needs to pick them up. Picks them up. This demon hunter uh, picks more up more ghouls. One ghoul's full hit point in the zeppelin. Picks up the uh, shredder. And look, look at Foggy defending. Foggy defends, but I still have music on in the background. Or do I? 
Oh no, this is a Warcraft 3 music. Never mind. Uh, there's a shredder dropping again. This is happening with all the hurt ghouls. Maybe it's time to buy a healing scroll. For the death knight. Oh, he's a death knight. He gets out. Okay. The ghouls here dropped here to take out the altar. Shredder. Shredder going for it. Oh, Shredder. Pick him up. Pick him back up. Okay. What the... Okay, we see tech here for Lucifer. Foggy. It's, it's just the stupid Shredder, guys. Stupid Shredder. It keeps being annoying. Death Knight just going back home. Gonna buy some skeletons, maybe? Here's some ghouls. There's a graveyard. These ghouls. <laughs> Lucifer is still 42 supply. He looks like four ghouls. Cancels. <laughs> <laughs> this is so so annoying. You should rather in your base with the Zeppelin. Imagine if you had the Acolyte in the Zeppelin as well that could repair the uh, Shredder. Hey, there's a panda finally. Are under there's the panda. What a game, guys. What a game. Hey, Shredder again. He's going for this Wisp. Can he get the wisp? Does uh, Foggy... Does he have wisp problems? Lumber problem? No. He has plenty of lumber. Ancient floor going up. Uh, Death Knight is creeping. He's level 4 now. There's... <laughs> cannibalize. Oh! Did he finish? Or did he cancel that? It, it didn't look like it was like close to finishing. But maybe it just went so fast that he did finish. There's an upgrade we uh, very rarely see. Okay, well, I love ghouls and <laughs> you kind of leave your base because the moment you leave your base, a bunch of ghouls cancel you. Oh! One ghoul goes down, the shredder survives. This ancient floor did go down as well. I'm not sure if it even was canceled there or if it was uh, destroyed. In either case, he bu bought some more time. Lucifer is almost at tier 2. Is he going straight to Black Citadel? Is he going for gargoyles? He is going for gargoyles. Uh, the reason we know this is because he didn't unsummon his second crypt. Right? If he was going for uh, anything else, he would have unsummoned the second crypt. And he would have uh, well done other stuff with his money. So, the death knight here creeping. These ghouls are going to cannibalize these ghouls. Cutting down some trees. Shredder also cutting down trees. Where's the cannibalize, Lucifer? Show it to me. There, there, look at the ghouls eating murlocs. Nom, 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 nom. Nom, nom, nom. This ghoul wasn't hungry. Nom, 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 nom. There was one more body, right? Nom, 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 nom. So, uh, Sintweller and Kesha. It's always Kesha. Always Kesha, guys. Insane how it's always Kesha. There's a Dryad Chan. There is. Another Dryad, maybe? Foggy? There it is, another dried and ultra vision. What a game! Murloc tastes like bad fish. Well, but ghouls they uh, for a ghoul that means it tastes like good fish. Because ghouls they look like they're rotten themselves. Okay, more ghouls eating, eating uh, no, some trolls this time and the sasquatch. This, this ghoul eats the sasquatch. He's the lucky ghoul. He gets the most delicious meal. I've never even eaten sasquatch in my life. I'm a bit jealous. I'm jealous of this ghoul, guys. Sure. Lucifer back to 50 supply. He has some dry uh, gargoyles. He's going to Black Citadel. There are some gargoyles. There they are. They're trying to kill these uh, dryads. The panda is level 2. Kesha, she's level 2. And we have three dryads. Is that it? Is he going to Tree of Eternity? Not yet. He's building more dryads. The panda, Kesha. Red fire hits like nothing. Maybe one gargoyle. Maybe that's it. We have a healing scroll here on Baron Bloodbane. He's also uh, decently close to level 5. There's no Lich yet, the guys. Forces are under attack. Okay, the Wisp survive. For what century is this strategy? Kesha is a girl's name. Well, the panda is a girl. Hello. Is panda a girl? Oh, you just asked me. Yeah, he's, she's a girl. Panda's a girl. The Zeppelin is flying around. On the other hand, the ghoul never tastes rice cakes, so I guess you're even. Good point. Good point. Kesha just wants to creep to level 3. And this ghoul? 
He's gonna eat some more troll. He's gonna eat? Not yet. Troll. Oh, he's eating some troll. Cloak of Shadows on the floor. Does the Death Knight pick it up? Does he pick up the Tome of Strength and the Cloak of Shadows? No, he doesn't want them. He's so close to level 5. So close. Look at the Zeppelin scouting. He sees the horse. He sees the villager. Here comes the Death Knight. He has the orb on the Death Knight. <laughs> Always interesting to see that orb when there's no synergy with it. It's still <laughs> worth buying the orb. I mean, he has some gargoyles. He has a few ranged units. If he had a lich or something, it would make sense. There's Gold Frenzy. There's Stone Firm. Oh, this Demon Hunter in trouble. Does he have a staff? Uh, no, but he has a other staff. Uh, Haze Breath of Fire Healing Scroll used here. The Demon Hunter does staff out. And this ghoul takes a bit of damage. This ghoul's against Dryads. There's not that many gargoyles. So I think Foggy should be able to uh, hold. He has Moon Walls as well. Well, ah, there's not a Breath of Fire. There's no more Healing Scrolls. There is level uh, 2 in Holy Aura, not level 3. Demon Dryad. He's going for the Demon Dryad. I don't like that. Demon Dryad is just too hard to kill. Uh, he's going for the Dryad now. This Dryad. She might die. And Breath of Fire. More Gargoyles dying. This Gargoyle. Also dead. And look at this, this fight here went horrible for Lucifer. Absolutely horrible. And there goes another gargoyle. He lost three gargoyles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ghouls. Eight ghouls for only killing three dryads, guys. And he lost his zeppelin as well. Maybe uh, one more unit got killed there and they used skeletons. But, uh, yeah, I mean, that wasn't a great fight for Lucifer. He's getting his Lich now. He's going for Fiends. Double Crypt, Fiends, Statue. Okay, Lucifer is not out of this game, though. He just need. He has a level 5 Death Knight. So if he gets that Lich, he gives that Orb to the Lich. One right-click on this uh, Panda, one Coil Nova. And he will have to use the Info Potion and Healing Potion. But then he dies a second later. Uh, Death Knight has, like, no items to save him. Yeah, I mean, the Ring of Protection and the Gauntlet, of course. Roar. Garg's such a bad move, Law. I think so as well. The Gargoyles were just a bit late. A bit too late. Nice info potion here. That's a nice item for the Demon Hunter. Ooh. Oh, Ghoul Chan. Ghoul Chan is still doing just fine. Shredder just cutting down all the trees. Lucifer has plenty of lumber. Over 1k. Lich has a potion of greater mana now. Maybe we want to give that to the Death Knight. Oh, Death Knight has a mana potion. Uh, nice breath of fire. Ghouls are dying. And gargoyles are flying. There. Now he's going for this. Uh, and the fiend is crying, guys. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. Moonstruck, for that beautiful poem. There goes that fiend. That fiend is dead. Uh, another breath of fire here. There go all the gargoyles. It doesn't look good for Lucifer anymore, guys. It looks like he's just absolutely getting crushed. But the hero kill or two might get him back in the game. And uh, with a level 5 Death Knight, he can always get that hero kill or two. He gives a healing potion to the Demon Hunter. He's still alive. Uh, Death Knight is going to die. Uh, or let's see if he can kill the Demon Hunter first. And the Death Knight does survive. Is this a comeback? The comeback that you guys were hoping for. You Lucifer fans, that is. Not the Foggy fans, of course. You guys were not hoping for a comeback with Lucifer. This uh, Panda uses the Info Potion by mistake for sure, right? Was it a mistake? Or was he just... Uh, he saw the Mana Potion used on the Lich. So he knew the panda was going to get Nova, but I feel like he used that info potion to dodge his coil, not to just not just use it. He wants to buy a Zeppelin. He buys a Zeppelin, but the coil kills him. Death that dies as well to the Dryads. But I, I'm not sure who died first, so I'm not sure if the panda got the XP from the Death Knight there. Uh, there goes the statue. Of course, the Lich was around to catch whatever XP the panda gave, even if the Death Knight died for uh, whether Death Knight died first or last or whatever. So, um, <laughs> what's this game? Well, we have expansion going up for Foggy. So, in other words, I don't know who's going to win this game. This is a beautiful game. <laughs> so, Panda died first. Okay, the Panda died first. So, that means uh, the Lich got half the mana. The Death Knight got the other half of the mana. And uh, mana uh, XP, I mean, and the panda got no XP from the Death Knight. These items are still there. The Zeppelin sees them. Oh wait, that's uh, Foggy Zeppelin. 
The statue might see them as well. It's just gonna creep his legs to level four. And does Lucy, does he, does he scout this? Back. There's still no, oh, the demon is back from the uh, tavern. Panda will be back from the altar. Okay, and there are the bears, guys. There's a dead bear. A dead bear upgrade. Demon to that side picks up the Tome of Strength. He's just stealing all this XP away. Not even stealing. He's just destroying this XP because he doesn't get the XP. Gets a rope of the Magi. Not a bad item. It gives it to the Lich. Uh, here is the Demon Hunter. Does he find these items at all? No, he doesn't care. No one cares apparently about this Cloak of Shadows and this Tome of Strength. Dar, Dar Lady Venom Tongue third. She's a uh, Naga. Naga third. Definitely bad position. He moves away from that position. And look at the statue. The statue is being hunted by Dryads, but it's still mass Dryads. He still doesn't have a bear. Okay, there's the first bear. There's a master form. Dryads, of course, are so useless against fiends. He needs those bears. Do we have a uh, destroyer upgrade? He's going for an abomination. Do you want to use the anti shell? There's no destroyer. Okay, there's a destroyer. Oh, panda. But this tree of life took so much damage already. It's uh, he could does he have a TP? Oh, he doesn't have a TP. If he had a TP, he could just right click and TP out. But he doesn't have a TP, so he just right clicks and uh, right clicks the demon demon hunter. We use the info potion. We have a mana potion on the death knight though, so the demon hunter has to be super duper careful. After this info potion is over, it is over. But the destroyer is he dead? There is Nova there to put on the lich. The demon hunter though, without the destroyer, can re heal so much with the rejuvenate. There goes the statue as well. The demon gets stopped out. This bear uh, is going to die. But Lucifer lost all his units. He lost his fiends. He lost like three fiends. He lost his uh, destroyer. He lost his statue. Uh, he killed the expansion though. So if he can't get out, he will still have another chance to kill the demon hunter again in the next fight and win the game. Has the abomination. Okay, how much gold left? Oh, not that much gold left. Foggy's just going for the free expansion, but he needs to upgrade Nature's Blessing. Foggy, don't forget it. Oh, he doesn't have the lumber. He needs more lumber. Foggy is in lumber trouble, guys. A player's forces are under attack. Lucy just creeping some more. Whoa. Cloak of Shadows. What if you picked up this Cloak of Shadows? Then you wouldn't have to pick up this one. Not that he's gonna use it, he's just gonna sell it, but I'm saying. Oh, he's gonna save it? Okay. Yeah, I mean, maybe... Uh, there it is. Beautiful play there by Lucifer. Sells that Cloak of Shadows. He does have a shade. He knows what's going on. He knows what's going on. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Clyde's repairing the shadow so he can go into battle. Into battle. The statue. Very nice statue. Demon Hunter, very nice Demon Hunter. There's Kesha, level 5 Kesha. A player's forces are under attack. So. Demon Hunter also wants level 5, I understand. Level 3 mana burn is absolutely amazing. Lucy wants this, uh, this item and the XP of course as well. Hello Dry, hello. Bye. What's Kesha doing here? Buying info potion. Hey, level five Sin Dweller and a Sobi mask. Maybe nice for Kesha. Maybe pick up the tome. Yeah, he picks up the tome. Ring of protection. He leaves that behind. And let's see if Lucifer is going to be creep jacked here. There's Nature's blessing. Is this a game-winning item? Let imagine a Ketka's pipe of insight. Lucifer will just win this game. Legion Doomhorn, that's the worst one. <laughs> that's even worse than Crystal Ball. <laughs> wow. Well, I we can sell it. Sell this item. Naga's level 2, Lich level 4. He did unsummon the Black Citadel. He did unsummon his second crypt. His Haunted Gold Mine. Is he going for a counter expansion? It does look like it. Cash is level 5. Sin Dweller level 5. Here we just have 5, 4, and 2. So, so actually right now the heroes are stronger here for Foggy I think. 5, 5 against 5, 4, and 2. Even if the Death Knight hits level 6, no one cares. This expansion maybe will uh, build it. 
Oh, it doesn't have the gold? And some another building. Two healing scrolls. What a game, guys. The tree of eternity sits down. The shade sees it all. It sees also these ancients. Setting up a defensive perimeter. What a game. So, ancient of war here. Beautiful. Sheep. Fine sheep. Yeah. Demon Hunter used the anti magic shell. Gets a 150 mana mana burn off on the Death Knight. And, well, the Demon Hunter is surrounded, but he has, uh, you know, it doesn't matter. He doesn't die. The Dry Doe, she dies. The Abominations don't have disease cloud. This bear takes so much damage. He's dead. He's dead to the Fiend. He used the Heal Scroll to save the Fiend. And now the Demon Hunter under, under attack. The Death Knight always has it. Oh, there's a coil. Uh, the, the Demon Hunter is he going to die? The Star of Stone cooldown. It gives the Info Potion to the Demon Hunter. Uses it. There's another Breath of Fire. The Shadow does go down. Cling, cling, cling. I read it in a second. And uh, this Dryad is still alive. And this Dryad also takes a bit of damage. Shade checking out the expansion. Uh, there another anti magic shell used. And another Mana Burn. This time on the Lich. Uh, no one has mana left here for Lucifer. So no more her Hero Nuke. Uh, Naga is, uh, is she dead? She's dead. Okay, is that Foggy that's gonna win this game? GG. GG, guys. GG. First game. Goes, a uh, second game. Goes to Foggy. What a game, guys. What a game. Okay, we have this game, guys. This is the third game and last game because it's best of three and it's 1-1 one, one between these two players. So the winner will win the cup, the Rudan Cup. The winner will, let's see how much money the winner wins. Let's, uh, let's look at it in the background while you guys look at Lucy's base. It's gonna be first place 313 USD, second place 156 USD. So, in other words, the difference between first place and second place is about 157 USD. Uh, there's a Death Knight for Lucifer, and that's a Clear Demon Hunter here for Foggy. Uh, Ace of the War here, eats a tree, attacks the Ogre Warrior in the face, and another time. Nice attacking in the face, it's just there. So. There's the Demon Hunter, Firebrand. Is Snooker to have a best of 35? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> but Snooker is a, is a silly game because it's like whoever takes first, he just wins, right? He just finishes the game by himself. And then sometimes a person makes a mistake. What is this? Scouting Necropolis here for Lucy. <laughs> Lucy. Maybe he wants some more fans. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> what is this, Lucy? He's gonna cancel it, of course. He's just buying some time. Uh, Demon is right clicking it, which means that uh, there's a cancel. He loses about. How much gold uh, money did he lose? I should have uh, checked how much gold he got back. He loses 25% by default, plus a little bit more of damage. So let's say he lo lost like 35%. There's like. 80 to 90 gold but he uh, the demon took some took some time here killing this necropolis which means uh, that might just be worth it because the death knight he got some, he got some creep kills he got some items he's level two demon is now also level two here comes the death knight Woo -woo. he's attacking this game does have graveyard up the skeletons go for the archer okay well skeleton goes down these skeletons over here Necropolis is just becoming the meta. <laughs> well, I'm sure uh, it, it did look very strong. There's a sentry word placed by the Death Knight. Some some skeletons. Oh, he's going for the no. He's, yes, he he's hiding for the de demon hunter. <laughs> and now he's going in. There's a hunter's hall going up. Guess it was. This archer is, has to be careful. This archer, guys. There's a firebrand though. He sees the firebrand coming in with the sentry ward, of course. Not that sentry ward. There's a sheep. This sentry ward. Uh, Death knight. Where did he place the other one, by the way? Over there. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. Bet. Of course, there's no boots. So the death knight walks faster than the demon hunter. Three archers. Okay. What do we have here? Nothing special. Nothing special, guys. Echolite. Remember, this is the acolyte that built the necropolis. He can always sneak back into the base. 
and pulled another necropolis so foggy has to be careful that this acolyte doesn't just build that necropolis for fun for for, sh for giggles <laughs> he's gonna creep this but lucifer sees it so let's see if lucifer can creep jack doesn't really have much to creep jack with these three ghouls they have to go down the lumber the trees he needs to lumber look he's very long lumber he has a lot of gold but long lumber so uh he can only go with one ghoul and two skeletons let's see if we can do some damage here the death team that gets a class of attack plus nine most you know uh i mean two creeps already dead he's going for the little baby knoll now there's a mana bird for 50. and there's a naga and there's a fiend okay well start shooting the demon hunter i guess oh coil on the demon hunter naga shooting the demon hunter. skeleton not blocking the demon hunter he's just free to go you're free to go the demon hunter hello he's going for the null warden sheep noises box champ they're the only one that responds to me no one else says something when i select them only the sheep and the piggies but i don't see any piggies or frogs Anyway, Demon Hunter's back. Oh, what is he doing here? He's stopping to the Naga. Again, Naga second for Foggy. Remember, he lost the first game when he went Naga second. He won the second game where he pa went Panda second. I'm just saying, it's, it's we always see the same shit. When we see Naga second, Knight of Loses. Doesn't matter, like, like how the, uh, anything else in the game doesn't even matter. There's, oh, the Koyo was too late though. The Ghoul dies. So he did get this Ghoul kill thanks to the Naga. So that's that's nice. That's nice, of course. And now we can kill maybe this forest tool warlord thanks to the naga. Uh, well, we could have done this with the pan as well, but here's the skeleton is a bit safer with the naga. This forest tool warlord. Are you serious? The skeleton got the kill. Are you serious? <laughs> Look how much XP this naga has. 118. Look at this naga. 26. Very nice skeleton uh, creep kill there on the level 6 tall warlord. But he does get one of the wind. That's a very nice item. There's some dryads. Well, it's, is it very nice though? We'll, we'll get the shores here pretty soon. Okay, well. Let's see what item he gets here. He gets both the items at least. Both the super items on this map. And he gets a book of the dead. Uh, so he uses it immediately to creep. I think he realizes that by the time they fight next, there will be destroyers out already. So uh, he just uses them to creep a bit. And you know, this is uh, something people learned in, uh, at some point. That uh, even if the book of the dead is not useful to fight, it's usually not worth to sell. Even if your opponent has mass dispo everywhere, it's usually better to just use the book of the dead to creep. The Death Knight here is almost level 3. Uh, and the Wisp detonated, so no level 3 yet. He needs 7 more XP. Firebrand is level 3. Nag is level 1. Of course, uh, Lucifer cannot fight until he's destroyers because of the Wand of the Wind. There's no way he can deal with that. And he doesn't have a TP, so he has to play a bit careful. He's playing a bit scared. Very nice play by Lucifer. Very nice. Very nice, guys. Very nice. So, this skeleton goes down. This gnoll is still alive. <laughs> Maybe we should kill the gnoll. That's what he's doing. Does he get bears? Yeah, there the, there's the first bear. There's Tree of Eternity. Maybe he will get Master Bear upgrade here in a moment. Like any moment now. Like right now, Foggy. I'm saying that you should get the Master Bear upgrade. Hello, Foggy. Forces are under attack. There it is. A bit late. There goes the troll. Ogre Magi is going down, guys. Couldn't he go uh, kill Akos with it? He, he could try to do that. Yes. It's just that he was... Uh, the position he was in, he was over here. He was uh, His units were a bit weak, so it would be hard to finish this creep camp. Uh, without the Demon Hunter, without the Book of the Dead. If the Demon Hunter went around the map, go for Acolytes or something. And... Um, it's not as easy as with the Blade Master. Blade Master just walks in and then use the Book of the Dead over here when he's windwalked. The Demon Hunter, he walks in 
And the scout, uh, the new tower will slow him. So then the units are walking super slow, super slow, super slow, super slow. And then over here, you can finally use the Book of the Dead. And the Eclides are already running, and everyone's already on the way. Oh, there's a Boneyard! I didn't expect the Boneyard because we saw the Naga second. Usually we see the Boneyard if we see uh, Death Knight first, Lich second, Tinker third. Right, that's what Happy does. And that's what uh, pretty much every... most other Frostworm players do as well, if they play Frostworms. Uh, this is something we've seen before from TBCBM, but this is Lucifer, not TBCBM. There's Destroyer form as well. Meanwhile, over here, the Demon and the Naga finishing the skip camp. Maybe he heard me. Maybe he, he realized, oh, fuck, he's bad against Frostworms. Let's build some Frostworms. But there's the Ancient of Wind. I'm not sure if he scouted this uh, Boneyard at all, or if he just expects it, or you know what. But there's the Ancient of Wind. No expansion, by the way, again. As I said, the Naga usually we have a late expansion or early expansion. Well, this game is going to be a late expansion again. You know, or no expansion, but that just means that he never gets the opportunity to get a late expansion. This uh, Scourge Bone Chimes, it looks super strong because of bears, but it's usually attack. not that strong. And I mean, you also have hippos. But the problem is. Uh, Usually it's, it's most of your ranged stuff that still does most of the damage. The Demon Hunter with the Orb is usually the one killing like the Frost Worms, the Destroyer, so then he's not a melee, a melee, so the Scourge Bone Champs doesn't work. The Naga, the Archers, the Dryads, they kill the Frost Worms and etc. They're all ranged. The Bears are just, they get slowed by the Frost Worms and they, don't, they do zero damage. And the Hippos, they get webbed and they also do zero damage. They're just buying time for the Bears to do a little bit of damage, so they don't do exactly zero damage. But uh, yeah, it's still worth keeping. There's a Sobi Mask as well on the Naga. Very nice. Very nice. This expansion, of course, is going to be cancelled. Or is it? There's a well, Solar Demon under defending. Naga is flying. Look at this list plus 26 damage. Hello? Hello. Oh, there's a cancel. This list might just win the game by himself. Is there a Fosfor out yet? There's one on his way somewhere. There's a shade in the center. Are the hippos out yet? Uh, I think that's the first hippo. Lucifer is just waiting for his one frost worm and then he can take the fight easy peasy. Lucifer went over 50. Oh, there's oh, uh, hippo, uh, there's a hippo and the shade went down. There's a second hippo actually. Does he have web? I don't know. If not, just secretly buying an item. TP, I think. The foggy crept all the high level camps, he got both of the uh, first of warlords. A player's forces are under attack. Okay, well this fiend is dead. There's a false worm, he's kinda in bad position though. He takes so much damage, there's a coil, there's a TP out. Can he? No, the, the Frost Worm is dead. So very bad, uh, very uh, bad position now for Lucifer. Losing the Frost Worm is so expensive. This is female. This is not female, guys. The Lich in the campaign is a um, is a male because it was Keltuzad, right? Keltuzad was a male, and uh, he had exactly the same voice, the same looks as the Lich, this this cryptic soul slayer. So I assume this one is a male as well. Tree of Life is going up. There goes uh, the Cobalt. He had an operation. Okay. Well, I mean, Lucy is going to stay under 50 supply for a while. All the creeps have been crept. So, Lucy, there's no reason for Lucy to uh, go over 50 just yet. Can wait a bit more. By the time this tree of life goes up, that's when Lucy decides to go over 50. Build one super army, attack, win the game, try to win the game. That's his plan, guys. Wow, no one that females besides Dark Ranger. It's 2018. Blizzard, wake up. Percuna said maybe you should wake up. Hello, there are plenty of females. What about the Banshee? You think the Banshee is not a female? What about the spiders? You think the spiders are not females? Then why are they shooting babies at their enemies? These spiders are all females. 
Uh, there's some nice unsummons on the buildings that he doesn't need anymore. You think the statues aren't females? Then why do they give birth to the destroyer? Does it make sense? I'm not sure if that makes sense. What about the Crypt Lord? The Crypt Lord gives birth to beetles. That has to be a female. What a game, guys. Shooting babies? Yeah, that's what they do. <laughs> they shoot babies. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. Like, for us humans, it, it sounds so horrible. But for the fiends, it's just the standard. It's just their life, guys. That's, what, how they li that's part of their culture. We cannot, we cannot criticize it. So, Lucifer going for some frost worms, Foggy going for some hippos, and more hippos. A double hippo building, guys. I think Foggy will halt, maybe. It, I mean, he doesn't have extra income yet. I think Foggy will maybe halt, guys. Such a nice pre prediction here by me. Wow. No hesitation in my voice at all. He will halt, maybe. Did you just assume my crypt fiend's gender? I didn't assume it. I did not assume anything. I just... I thought about it. I... Uh, looked at all the evidence we have. And then I concluded... That the fiends are female. You shouldn't doubt a <laughs> focus ability th to throw in any situation first and that. Okay, Sidrin, you're right. How do they shoot babies? I thought it was web, like Spider-Man. Uh, no, that's web. Web is web, but their attacks are little babies, little baby spiders. There's a lot of claws on the list. Yeah, actually the list can still win the game by himself, like I said earlier. 67 supply against 71. Okay, we have the enter magic shell, but it could be dispelled, but he did he miss the dispel or something? This fiend is so much trouble, there's a coil. Uh, here come the hippos, seven hippos. We only have four fiends, guys. Four, yeah, I mean, this one died. is dead. Four fiends, statues, leaves the statues behind. Lucifer. Oh, Demon Hunter in a bit of trouble, though. Demon Hunter has to be careful. This Lich does too much damage for him to just walk around. Expansion is, is up now. This Demon Hunter has to be super duper careful. If he loses the Demon Hunter, Foggy can still lose the game, guys. And, you know, like we said, it's Lucifer. He, uh, it is uh, Foggy. He used the Info Potion. The cool goes down. Mana burn was beautiful. Nova on what? Eek. I don't know what he got Nova on. There's a coil on the fiend. Here come the hippos. They want to kill the frostworm. But there goes a the hippo. The frostworm takes a coil. He's still alive. So many hippos. It's insane. Naga in the front. Uh, maybe someone wants to kill her. Yeah, uh, I mean, she has to use the info potion. Frostworm's flying home. They don't want to die. The Naga here in trouble. She has a healing potion. She uses it. Death demon hunter. Gets stuffed out. But now the Naga in trouble. She has a TP. The Naga here dies. GG. Lose for Jesus out. Foggy wins, guys, in the end, 2-1 in the finals. He is the winner of the Rudan Cup. He will get to play basketball with Rudan. I think that was also part of the prize pool.